back to Wind Games 2018 here at Windor, and we've had incredible engine action. This tunnel has been going 24 hours for days and days and days. Well, how does that happen? Let's find out. I'm here with Jose Manuel Colados. Is that correct? Correct. Hello. Yeah. Hi, my, hello, my friend. And with ABB, ABB, you're the local division manager, is that right? Yeah, I'm responsible for the robotics and motion uh, division that uh, also takes care of the dry uh, business in Spain. And we, uh, I remember last year here at Wing Games, we were talking to one of your colleagues about the technology. Just give us an idea of what ABB does involved in the tunnel. What is the uh, technology? What happens? Well, uh, this tunnel is, uh, is controlled by four uh, massive uh, fans that are um, uh, moved by four motors that are operated by ABB industrial drives. And also the control has ABB programmable controllers, PLCs. And the wind speed that comes through, it's stronger than a hurricane, lifting people out from the bottom of the net. How do we control that? Yeah, it's true. Uh, the control must be very accurate. Uh, we can control the airflow by the fans uh, in a way that we can go from zero to 300 kilometers per hour in 10 seconds. So this is like a Formula One car. And this is done uh, by ABB industrial drives that control the motors. And what happens, what happens if these motors fail? Does everybody just crash down onto the net? Yeah, don't worry, Ryan. Uh, I, and please believe me, there is no, no problem. The, the tunnel has been designed in a way that even if the electricity was cut in this side, uh, there will be no problem. There is a certain inertia that will man maintain the wind drivers flying. And also, uh, there is a... Uh, the uh, uh, four uh, four fans operating at the same time, so even if one of them was failing, the three would maintain also the, the airflow. And also the system is modular, and there is a, a technical operators here uh, to help if this is required. But normally it's very, very reliable. How do you feel about the whole wind tunnel environment that you're getting involved i mean all abb is a big international firm and what you're doing here with the tunnel is a very small part of the operation but it it must be quite exciting for the company yeah well this is a uh, the latest technology applied to 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 this new spot the atmosphere is fantastic you know abb we are very concerned about sustainability and uh, and, uh, and, and this comes in relation, and we are also participating in other things like Formula Electrical, Formula E. So, and, uh, so this is very exciting to be here. We are part of this. And to make these games work, like I was saying at the beginning, these machines, these engines have been going almost 24 hours a day for nearly a week now. It's not a problem. It's not a problem. The system is modular, we have uh, technical people, and the system is extremely reliable. Don't worry, this will not stop. What about people watching at home, thinking about these fans and the power, thinking, oh, it's a lot of energy they must be using, a, you know, is it good for the environment? What about the power consumption? Yeah, the power consumption on this side at top power is 1.5 megawatts. This is extremely uh, high, it's a lot, uh, but the system is uh, extremely... Uh, uh, it's very modern, so uh, we are even using re regenerative systems. So when the air is going up, the when it's going down, we are taking this power back to the system, back to the grid. And what you've got here, is, tell me what this device is. Well, this is a, an ABB drive. It's, not, it's a little bit smaller than the ones that we have here, but it's the same technology. So it's based on power electronics, and it, uh, it is used to control motors, speed, and, uh, and performance. And we get almost an instant reaction from the driver who decides to go up or down the motors. It doesn't take a, not a long time. It's almost instantaneous, the reaction, no? Yeah, as we told you, we can control the speed very, very fast. It's true that the power is massive, so this tunnel can move up to 1,000 uh, uh, cubic meters per second. So that amount of wind could make uh, could, uh, fire could fill a balloon in two seconds so yeah it's a big power with very high accuracy it's a high technology fill a balloon in two seconds that's incredible because one of my uh, commentary jobs is on balloon races and that would really speed up the operation have you had a flight yet in the tunnel have you been inside 
Not yet, not yet. I'm looking forward. Are you going to have a go? Do you fancy it? Of course, of course. I promise. Well, thank you very much, Jose Manuel Calaros from ABB. It's been a pleasure having you around, and I hope you're enjoying these world-class competitions. Yeah, I'm enjoying a lot. Thanks a lot, Brian. Thank you. Thank you.